Today we're going to talk about tides. On the earth, on the sea, we have our land and surrounded by all the water on planet earth and the rotation of the earth allows for us to experience tide coming in and going out. If we were standing on a pier, we would notice it that at one stage of the day the water will be really, really high and six hours later it will be extremely low. This is high water and low water and it occurs along our coastlines. What does that mean to us as boaters? Basically, we have a slipway here and as you can see at the bottom, it's covered in rocks. The advantage is when the tide comes in, this water will increase the ability for us to access the water. The tide is here is low water and as more tide comes in, it comes in in a different rate and then allows the boat to safely go onto the water. So at this stage, we now have high water and the boat can safely navigate over the rocks and carry on its journey. What's really important for us as boaters is to understand what time is low water, what time is high water, and how much height is there in the difference so that for our journey, we don't hit any rocks. And that makes sure that we can navigate safely. The other part of the tide is our journey will take longer if the tide flow is going against us. However, if we were to look at our tide times and figure out if I waited and had the tide going out, then the tide would actually speed us up and we'd make the same journey in quicker time. So where to find out this information is on our website in sailing.ie forward slash tides. Best of luck.